fleet is to the north of us. This could be a really important jibe. Hopefully we can keep the pressure, everything will rotate right. We'll be off on the long curve round to New Zealand. We're trying to sneak through the, the light wind zone. Turning along with nothing around, trying to steer a course and then out of the blue comes one tiny little rock that's 800 metres long and it's right on the bow. Actually had to change our course to miss the thing. Apparently it's called Kito Iwashima. We're nearly back to Sanya's latitude. 12, 15 knots on the beam. Days like this make it all worthwhile where you're just smoking along. Really nice sailing. It's great. We broke our J2 in half. What happened was the tack rope on it broke that holds it down at the front. Soldy Darrell hit down here now, fixed it away, so it'll probably be good to go in 10 hours or so, 12 hours, I guess. We kind of need it, it's the sail we should be on, we just have to see if we can minimise, minimise too many losses to these other guys. A lot of thunderstorm activity predicted down the track. Um, we've certainly been having a few good storms of the night time and early morning. Uh, the last couple of nights, so I think we'll see some pretty big gains and losses and hopefully we need to be on the good side of a few of these ones and to get back into this. You just filmed this, just uh, getting whacked by one of the little thunderstorms. It gets up to 35 knots. Uh, you don't have time to change the jib. They move down quite fast, so all you got to do is bear away, go with it, and then it's Hoping everything stays in one piece, so uh, you know, we'll probably average about 24 knots an hour. A little off course, not too bad. And it's good. 